News from Jackson celebrating Women's History Month by highlighting local, local women and their impact on the community. We asked for your nominations and now we're sharing some of the stories that you shared with us. And News for Jags reporter Lena Pringle is here. And Lena, you spoke with a local woman who's created a safe space for women to achieve their goals. Good morning, Corley and Bruce. Stephanie Jones is the founder of Women at Work and she also runs a private practice for mental health outpatient services. The person who nominated her says Jones has created a safe space for women to network within their community. Her annual Women at Work Empowerment Conference features local women's, and local women's small businesses. I have always been just naturally curious to understand human behavior. This curiosity birthed Jones's private practice, lifestyle management counseling. Noticing some of the maltreatment towards folks that were struggling with mental health just due to their own lack of understanding, wanting to be more of a change agent in that. So developed a private practice out of that. Um, I have worked at inpatient psychiatry, child welfare. Uh, my favorite is couples and teen girls. While Jones's impact is felt by her clients, it has extended to women across the River City through the creation of Women at Work. The organization supports women and their unique entrepreneurship challenges through a variety of networking. We would essentially visit different places around Jacksonville to really expose you know, the ladies to new stuff here, you know, so I always love meeting people over food, right? That's the that's the best way. And that's actually how I learned my way around Jacksonville was because we were frequenting different restaurants, you know, every quarter getting dolled up and dressed up. And that dinner party has now turned into a conference, which has now turned into a co-work space. You have dedicated a lot of your passion and your goals and really your life towards empowering all different kinds of women from young to old and in between. So how does it feel to know that your impact is being felt across this community? Their feedback is always the gift that keeps on giving is because it always helps to reinforce, you know, things that I feel, right? I want to be able to be a light, right? Not only for myself and the patients that I see in my regular job, but even in you know, philanthropic efforts as well. Jones has these words of encouragement for women working towards achieving their goals. Work for it. And that's in two meanings, right? Because women at work is spelled with an E instead of an O on purpose, right? To encourage empowerment. So I would say work for it in both ways, right? While you're working on yourself and you're being disciplined and you're being diligent towards the highs and the lows of small business, you also have to work for it with an E as well to empower someone else as you're coming up along this journey. Women at Work is now in its fifth year and has a co-space to expand and continue its mission. You can learn more about this organization and Jones's other work inside this story on newsforjacks.com. You can also still nominate an exceptional woman in your life to be featured on Channel 4. Coralie, Bruce.